going on guys, I'm back for another tutorial using Adobe After Effects CS6. In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to add text using the tracker software. So basically what this does is kind of it locks the text onto an object in the video. So I'm going to go ahead and import the video I'm going to use. And this is um, our new movie we've made. Check it out on my channel if you haven't seen it already. But it's pretty cool. So I'm going to drag that on from project and just have a little bit that we want to do. So just adjust the mountains thing there. It's not the right place. So find the bit that you want to add text to. A lovely actor there. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Right. You get to the right bit. Right, you see it's got the grass there and the kind of drive there. To get the tracker software to work, first of all, we are going to use, um, well, make sure it's selected, then go to Effect, then Perspective, and then 3D Camera Tracker. So what this does, if you look up here, it initializes or initializes, um, and then it will check every single frame and see if it can hold on to anything. So depending on how fast your CPU is or how fast your GPU is, um, it may take a while. So I'll be back in a second. So after it has successfully tracked the image or the video, um, you'll see all these dots appear. So if you just scrub through the video, it may go blurry depending on what you're doing. Um, but you see all these different points. So you find, you see, or if you hover over, you find the target. Now you see it can change perspective where you, well, it's depending on where you put it basically. So you scrub through until you get, or sometimes um, it doesn't find the right points. You scrub, scrub through until you find the right place to put it. I want it here. So you click, and you see these three triangles appear. So you right click on them and then create text and camera so down here it has text so now basically you just um, double click it and then you can type in what you want so the extreme sounds my youtube name and then I'm just going to make it a bit smaller using um, the controls over here and to zoom in, you just use a scroll wheel, scroll wheel on your um, mouse, and that, now you can just zoom in. And up here, you can use the hand tool, just to no, sorry, not the hand tool. It drags the actual video. Um, use the uh, what have I done? <laughs> Haven't done this in a while, guys. So. Right there you go. Um, use the selection tool and then you can click and drag the text where you want. Make it smaller or just play around with it to be honest. Um, it is quite fun doing this because you can add some real professionalism to your videos. I quite enjoying use I quite enjoy using this with video which I'll show you in the next tutorial. Um, just get that in line with the fence. Like so. If I put it there, and then make it a bit smaller. Like that. No. Nope. I'm gonna. Right. This way. Nope. Sorry, I have not done this in a while. It's right. There. So I've positioned it on the fence and if you just go to here and click fit it will go back again and click on your video so there if you just scrub through you can see it perfectly appears on the fence like so so thank you very much for watching my um, After Effects tutorial using CS6 and I hope you um, join me to see the other tutorials I'll do